congratulations, mate. Um, as I just said, I didn't see your fight apart from the last round. So do you want to talk me through it? Yeah, he was he was strong. I mean, he was coming out coming off of a knockout win. Hence the prospect was uh, seven and one, I think. So I knew he was going to be strong. He was really strong. I actually boxed this fight at 70 kilos. I'm usually boxing uh, 147, so it was a, a step up for me. I think he was, he'd come down from the weight above. I'm not too sure. He, he, he was a big, big opponent. He's there, but you felt his power a bit. Hasn't yeah, it? yeah. He caught me with a few um, uppercuts and hooks and that, but really and truly, I sort of, I wasn't, I was slipping in, but I wasn't as defensively sound because I knew he was going to knock me out. I wanted to open, get him to open up a bit. Yeah. So. But at any point, did, did you think, like, you know, I'm in a bit of a fight here, usually, no disrespect to like, a journeyman, mm. but you know, yeah, the you, you kind yeah. of expected to win. The, fir the first punch, yeah. I threw a jab, and he bounced, he, he parried one, caught me with one. Yeah. I thought, oh, fucking hell, he's crafting. Yeah. But, like, you just sort of zone out in there, you can adapt, and I started sort of fainting, throwing my jab downstairs, sort of faint, um, catching him in, and eventually I, I caught him with a big right hand. Yeah. From there, I think he was backing off a bit. Um, Sorry. Did you do much prep for him? Like, as you knew, you know, he mm. deserved a bit of power, or was it...? No, I was sparring Jermaine Brown, who's actually boxing yeah. now. He's about 70... I think he's about 78 kilos, mm. so... You know, I was sparring bigger boys. What about, like, checking your phone out? Did you, did you like... Oh, mate, there was no tape on him until two days ago. Right. So I saw him chin someone. <laughs> and, uh... Yeah, but other than that, nah. But sure. I was quite happy he was willing to fight, do you know what I mean? Because... Uh, lots of the boys I yeah, fight no, just want to survive. Oh, yeah. 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 I, I, obviously, it's a win, a win, a win, but still, it's like, you know, mm -hmm. as you said, like, kind of off camera, like, you know, you want to come and look him out, but yeah. sometimes that shit like, yeah, yeah, it's a learning curve, isn't it? It's still a learning curve, still earlier than what have you. Um, yeah. what's, what's probably uh, the next time we're going to see you out there? Well, I've boxed, I've boxed five times since I turned pro, which is just, mm -hmm. just under a year, year ago, so uh, I'll, have a, I'll have a rest of fighting, I'll stay in the gym. Um, Probably late July, early August, I'd say. There's quite a long time. Um, yeah, I'll probably say around then, and then I'll be back probably, hopefully, another two or three this year. Yeah, because when we did that interview, it's like at some point, you know, you won't come in, you've got to step up and yeah. eight, eight round, eight, ten rounds and stuff. But again, you're still, you know, young, it's not like yeah, a yeah. rush, but same point as you want to test, which you did tonight. Yeah, there's, there's, yeah, there's no rush, there's no rush. I mean, that wasn't an easy fight by anything, so if I wasn't on it, he probably would have beaten me on points because he was quite active, so. And, and coach, what, were the coaches happy with your performance? Yeah, yeah, he said I was a bit harsh on myself because mm. I wasn't one hundred percent happy with it. But yeah, he was, he was happy with it. Well, at least that was kind of hard. Yeah, yeah. But um, all right, listen, um, we've got a queue of people. Um, uh, wait to hear. <laughs> <laughs> um, just the one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Still a queue. Yeah, popular demand. Bigger like than me, so. Yeah. <laughs> um, do you want to shout out like uh, social media so people follow you, follow you, and um, yeah. obviously sponsors? Well, thank you for everyone that came. I started yeah. singing my name in the end. I was. Uh, that was good. Um, sponsors, yeah, I just thank all my sponsors. Dylan House Foundation, uh, New Era, Pilgrim Brewery, and uh, oh, you've brought me out here. Yeah. Um, Homes of Heroes. Yeah. yeah. Do, do, do you want to do that bit again? Or nah, sorry, don't worry. Um, I've, I've just been in a fight, so yeah, I'll be in the benefit of the doubt. Well, listen, thanks very much to uh, talking to us and also catch up with you. Yeah, thank you very much. Thank you.